So welcome to Awaken, Jason. Thank you, much appreciated. You started your youth career at Arsenal at a very young age. Tell us about your time there and how long you were there for. Yeah, um, started off very young, from about the age of nine to about 14, 15. That was a good, good experience. Taught me a lot about football and got a lot to do with how I play my game now. Who did you play with last year at Arsenal? Uh, from, don't want to throw too much names out there, but the likes of Jack Walsh, I'm just playing in the Premier League at Bournemouth. From my Arsenal alone, uh, Ben Kofobi, that was my kind of age group. Joey Jones as well. Joey Jones, yeah. Um, he's one year younger than me, but I played with Joey. And you spent some time at Blackburn Rovers in their youth set up. You top yeah. scorer there, were you? Yeah, in the youth team, that was good. Left Arsenal and went there, that was good to spend a couple of years there. That was decent. So, tell us a bit about your style of play and what position you see yourself playing at Waking. Um, I could play in any of the attacking positions, preferably on the left or behind the striker. What are your like, main attributes? And um, very good one on one. I can beat a player one on one. I'm quick and this creativity, really. After leaving Blackburn, you joined Liverpool. How did that move come back? Um, some of the staff that was at Blackburn moved to Liverpool and taught me taught me with them kind of thing. So that was good. You also spent a short time over in America. It must be interesting. Nah, that that, uh, that story's come out, but it's not really. I never played out there. I just went to go see a mate, and he played out there. So um, you joined Crystal Palace in the summer of 2012, where you went online to Plymouth and MK Dons. Yeah. That's a good experience. Yeah, that was good. Um, signed under Dougie Freeman, but he moved on to Bolton. But then I really came through when Ian Holloway came in, handed me my debut in their pick up against Stoke. So that was good. And then went along to Plymouth for a down well. And then the season after, went along to MK Dons in League One. And you signed permanently for Plymouth in 2014. Yeah. At that game. Yeah, that was all right. It um, wasn't as good as my lawn spot because of injuries, but it was nothing serious. It was just little niggles. And then um, towards the end, we done well, got to the playoffs. Didn't quite go up, but yeah, it was very good. And you scored in the semi-final? Yeah, I scored in against Wickham, yeah. And then you, most recently you were at Corley Town. How did you go last season then? Yeah, it was an um, up and down season. Um, started off well, played games. Um, then going into Christmas, wasn't playing as much. I went alone to Party Fissile. But I was unfortunate to get an injury in my first week up there, so I didn't end up playing much towards the end of the season. So, what attracted you to the for Logan? The manager, really. I met with the manager, and that was really that, what grabbed my attention. Cool. So, excellent. So, thank you for your time. I'm looking forward to seeing you back at Logan. Definitely. Thank you.